Uh, so welcome back guys. This is a quick tutorial on solving the Android bug which is unfortunately of app stopping. Here we can see that Paytm has stopped. In your case whatever the app may be let's look at how to solve this. Go to the phone settings and from there to apps. Then particularly go to the app that has misbehaved. In this particular case this is Paytm. So I actually go to Paytm. For the particular app, what I will request you to is for stop the app. So if it's running in the background, it will go ahead and stop. Then you need to go to storage, which is more important. Here you need to clear the cache. So whatever is in the memory would clear off. Be a bit careful and check if the app has started to work. If it's not working, then you can go ahead and clear the data. If you clear the data, it's as good as the app being uninstalled and reinstalled. So you need to do everything again. The app loses its data. Once you have done this, I will also advise is like, you know, go to the apps and here you click on reset app preferences. So everything like, you know, all the stuff like is kind of flushed and you won't be losing any existing data, but this will kind of help reset to the perfect settings. So try doing these three things. The fourth that I would suggest is like in case you are using a SD card, what you can do is check whether the SD card has gone corrupt. Try moving the app into the internal storage of the phone and then like see if the app is working. If that also fails, you can go to the Play Store, uninstall and then reinstall the app. But please do this only after you have observed the step of clearing the cache and the data. Once you have uninstalled and then reinstalled the app, it may start working. So you can now try using the app and it should work. One more thing that you can try doing if it's not all working, then you can simply like reboot the phone. You can power off and then power on the device. This is also called as a soft reboot and doing this once in a while is good. It kind of flushes out the system and improves performance of the apps. So once you do this, I think things should work. Now you can try using the phone. So this should help like the phone flush out and optimize performance of apps. Now the last resort that I will advise is simply going on to the phone settings and from here trying to factory reset. So here it's available under general management and here you can see you have an option of factory resetting. But what this means is you are absolutely trying to make the device as it was when it came right out of the box. So don't do it if you don't have backup. So first take a backup and then try doing this but at the last. So we saw six methods but the first method wherein you go to the settings and you go to the apps. And from the apps, you go to the particular app which is misbehaving. In this particular case, it was Paytm. For your case, it may be something else. What I have seen is if you go to the app and then like four stop and then clear the cache and the data and try seeing the app, it will really work. But yes, when you clear the data, it's like you have to again put in your account details and stuff like this. If you like the tutorial, click on subscribe, share the bell icon. Sorry, share it with your friends. Also click the bell icon for getting notifications. Thank you.